Hello, I am your host Luan and this is co-host Bob. Today we are going to be doing a Google Translate video. If you don't know what Google Translate is, I basically took a recipe of sugar cookies and ran it through Google Translate through tons of different languages until I got something very weird. So today Google Translate is going to make me sugar cookies. Let's get started, shall we? <clears throat> Let's get started. Contents butter and sugar the fruit come out to fix of the soldiers vanilla scent interested in sugarcane what that's just the contents of the sugar cookies soldiers i mean i don't know step one i guess uh sift the flour salt and pepper into a large bowl give it to them Pepper! Salt I can kind of understand, but pepper in a sugar cookie? Um, what do you mean? Huh? Sift flour, salt and pepper. Let me just get out. Flour, salt and pepper. I'm using black pepper because we are... Uh, sift the flour, salt and pepper. I'm not gonna sift it because I don't want it. Some flour, some salt and um, pepper. Give it to them. Here you go. <laughs> no? Okay. Next step. Add butter and sugar to your mixture and form a bowl. Uh -huh. Butter and sugar. Add butter and sugar to your mixture and form a bowl. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna use this. I don't wanna waste ingredients. I want to add enough um, sugar to extinguish the flavor of the black pepper. Step, oh yeah, and form a bowl. I, oof. Um, the butter is as hard as a rock. I mean, how do you form a bowl with that? Let's just form a bowl. There you go. I formed the bowl with it. I don't know what it means, but I guess so. Step three. Add the eggs to the mixture. Wash the sides of the bowl. Can I undo the bowl? Because I can't open the fridge. Add the egg. The egg to the mixture. Oh, and there's some eggshell in there as well. Uh, wash the sides of the wall. Why? Uh, step four. Add one teaspoon of vanilla extract and mix well. That's actually the normal, that's the only normal step in this recipe. I'm just gonna use the cap. This is actually starting to look like something. Step five, I think. Add the flour wheel and mix everything well. Oh wait, I forgot to mix, wait a bit. Um, add the flour wheel and mix everything well, making sure the plate is clean. The flour wheel? This is the only thing I could get that is close enough to a wheel. It's a water bottle cap. So, I guess we fill it up with flour. A flour wheel. Or oh, add it and mix it well, I guess. I just need to remember that there's actually plastic in there. Hopefully I don't forget. Uh, step 6. Pour the mixture into a plastic bag. Seal and place in a refrigerator to seal. When the flour has cooled, roll it up, sprinkle it on the flour and roll it up. Huh? What? So, let's just do the first step. Pour it into a plastic bag. Oh, I don't know why. So, it says we can, we have to seal the bag, but it's, I can't seal this bag. So we now have to put it in the refrigerator to seal. So, hopefully when and it needs to cool down, so, okay, it's been an hour, I think, I'm not sure. Uh, what was the step? Pour the mixture into a plastic bag, seal the bag, refrigerate, the oh, we, it's in, here it is, um, and I just remembered, we didn't put on the, 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 the oven, so I'm gonna do that. Next step, I guess, when the flour has cooled, Roll it up, 
sprinkle it on the flour and roll it up. Um, so let's just get a baking plate thing. Okay, I got this. So, um, what do we need to do? I'm confused. Sprinkle it on the flour and roll it up. So I guess we pour a bit flour on the pan thing. Wait, you can't see this. Let me just... I hope you can see that. Yeah, you can. <coughs> so we sprinkle a bit... What do you... Wait, what, what? Roll it up. Sprinkle it on the flour. And roll it up. So I guess we pour this out of the bag. Or we squeeze it. Um, we squeeze this out of the bag on the flour. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That looks... <laughs> I don't know if you can see this. Woo! <coughs> Um, I just tasted it and it burnt, <laughs> so I get- oh yeah, we, uh, there was pepper inside, so. Uh, sprinkle the uh, flour, roll it up, add an unrelated group. Add an unrelated group? Of what? Sprinkles? I can do that. So, here goes the sprinkles. This is gonna be good. I can feel it. Ooh. Uh. <coughs> Take the paper again and fold it again to get the cookies again. <laughs> A wax wrap. Oh! So take the paper and fold it. Like, do we need to fold it around the cookie? Place on light baking sheet and bake at uh, 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 12 minutes. Uh, I already did that. It's 198 degrees Celsius, so I think the oven is on the right thing. When done, place it on the cookies before looking for a thread to dry completely. So let's just wait for the oven to get ready, then we can bake it, I guess. So, see you when the oven is ready. Okay, it's been a few minutes and the oven is ready, so let's put our monstrosity inside the oven. You're gonna do good, I guess. So now we wait 12 minutes, which I don't think is enough, so <laughs> hopefully it's going to be enough. I have to... Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. Why is it boiling? Um, I don't think that's how it's supposed to look like, but... There's the cap. Okay, donkey. Uh, let's just wait for it to... <laughs> ah! So, I'm just going to take these biscuits. I don't have cookies. But I have biscuits and um, pack it all around the, the, the plate. Okay, there we go. It's a very, very oily. I didn't, yeah, you can see that. Oh my goodness. That was Google making me a one, a sugar cookie. Let's taste, shall we? Oh, that's so good. Mm. And I'm definitely going to sit on the toilet for a few hours because I ate that. If you guys want to see some more Google Translate videos or videos like this, please leave a like and subscribe if you're brand new. We will greatly appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. How?